All right, so now we are going to talk about how we're going to wire up these very nice Apile switches. So this is the wiring diagram that comes in the pack with the switch. There are two ways to wire it up. And I'm going to go through here and kind of explain in a little bit more detail what these two different ways are. So right here on the top of the page, it says switch connect to normally open pin, press the button, LED light is on. So in this scenario, the light in the switch is off when your device is off. So it'll indicate when it's turned on by turning on its own little LED light. So there is a very small positive and negative indicator on the switch itself. Your positive and your normally opened wire to the clockwise of the positive are going to be tied together and go to your device. And in this case, the device is your relay. And then for your normally opened wire to the counterclockwise of the positive on the switch, this is going to your power. So in this case, this is going to our add a fuse in the fuse panel. And then your negative of the switch is going to be connected all the way back to your fuse panel. Or it can be grounded to a body ground. The next way that we can wire up these switches is that the LED light is always on regardless of if the device is on or not. If there is power going to the switch the LED light is on on the switch. This is the way that I've chosen to wire my switches up. So again we have a positive indicator on the switch and a negative indicator on the switch. In this case your positive on the switch and the normally open wire to the counterclockwise of the positive is going to the add a fuse on the fuse panel. Then your normally open wire to the clockwise of the positive wire. This is going to the relay just by itself. So I have our signal wire here. It is stripped and it is ready to go. This is going to be our wire that runs to the relay to tell that we've flipped the switch. And then your negative is going to go back on a body ground or back on the fuse panel. Now we're going to go over how to wire a relay. And just like the switch, there are a couple ways to wire this one up. The way that we're going to talk about today is how to wire with a positive trigger source. So that means when you flip the switch, your switch will then start providing current to the relay. So there are five wires on a Bosch style relay. There is black, red, yellow, blue, and white. This yellow wire is not used and we just cap it off with a little bit of heat shrink tube. Your red wire is your power wire, your main power. So you have it fused and then going to the battery. So in my install, this is going from the relay to the fuse box to the battery. And now let's grab our 12 gauge and figure out our run. now 
we can connect our relay power and our fuse power. Then you have just a simple ground. This gray wire coming out this other side is going to the positive trigger source. So this is your switch. So the way we wired up our switch will be this wire right here, the blue wire that is clockwise from the positive on the switch. Signal to relay. Move these up around here where we can work with them. So we need our white signal wire. And we'll get these two together. And then you have finally the blue wire, which is going to the device. So this is going up to the light. Yeah.